There are many schools of thought when it comes to cars. They're not just transportation. Automobiles are about engineering, art, and even social studies. I'm Tom Volk with Driven for the New York Times. The 2013 Nissan Sentra is one of the newer kids on campus in the very crowded compact class. This segment has become so competitive in the last few years. Let's see, there's Civic, Corolla, Cruze, Mazda 3, Focus, Jetta, Dart, Elantra, Forte. Uh, you gotta do your homework. Sentra does well in economics. This mid-range SV model stickers for $20,600 with destination and two major option packages. That means there's an easy way to start the engine and driving directions once you do. Hope you're not in a hurry. Zero to 60 happens in around nine and a half seconds. The suspension soaks up bumps nicely. Since it's tuned for comfort, Sentra won't be picked first in gym class like the athletic Mazda 3. The Nissan does well in physics though. Fuel economy is EPA rated at 30 city, 39 highway. Driving like the school bully, I'm averaging 29 MPG. The four-cylinder is a 1.8-liter unit that makes 130 horsepower. It's a Nissan, so the automatic is a continuously variable transmission with a mild rubber bandy sort of dynamic. Sport mode gives it some crispness. Students of the classics can get a six-speed manual on the base model only. Visibility is good, center is moderately quiet on the highway. Put your foot into it in hard city driving, and you'll really hear the engine. Plus, because of the dynamic of the CVT, it drones. Looks like a sculpture major did the interior. Materials look and feel good. Gauges are clear and readable. Door releases feel great. Make sure you like beige, though. Slobs and parents with toddlers would be smart to go with the darker interior colors. In the music department, tunes sound decent considering the price. Geography? Well, the Nissan Connect system allows you to send addresses from your home PC to the Navi system so there's less hunt and peck in the car. Finally, reading. It can speak incoming text messages. You can reply using voice command. I would demonstrate using my iPhone, but it isn't supported yet. The back seat is roomy for the class. Two six-footers will fit fine here. Only one gets a seat pocket, though, and to charge phones, they'll have to mooch off the power port that's inside the front armrest. You might be wondering, why test the trunk with bath tissue? Well, it's a practical, everyday shape about the size of a roll-away suitcase, a little bit more humorous, plus it's lighter and more consistently shaped than textbooks and backpacks. The seats split and fold. Check out the big lip left over. No need to do geometry with bundles of this. Sentra matches some mid-sized sedans, scoring a seven in the TP trunk test. No grab handle means no extra credit. There's a family resemblance to A Student Ultima. Sentra is swoopy, but chunky, making it uh, swunky. It gets hip jewelry. LED accents on both ends are standard, but wheel covers? Nerd alert, alloys are optional. Sentra is not valedictorian in this overachieving class. It needs to study a little harder in art, plus the CVT and suspension tuning will keep it off the track team. It's comfortable, roomy, and nicely dressed inside though. Reasonably priced and fuel efficient, Nissan Sentra is a good class treasurer.